Mamie. Sweet Mamie. Sweet Mamie. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it kind of looks like a bone. Oh, Jesus. I think he's going to like it. What are we doing today? We are randonating again. Yay! So we have opened, it's a new year. It's a new year. And we have opened the app. Should have filmed this whole way, but it's been a pretty long drive. Um, so we went out of the way on this one and we almost ran out of gas, so. Um, <laughs> that is true. The, our intention for this one was something beautiful. And so far it has not disappointed. I mean, this, is gorgeous out here. It's beautiful. There's a marshmallow farm. I don't know if that's a marshmallow farm. Yeah, those are marshmallows that are planted. They're growing. It's a marshmallow farm. There, now I can see it better. Look at the hill. You don't see hills very often here in Florida. This is a very hilly area. We're going downhill. Looks like the rest of the hills are coming down. So if I had to guess, there's probably going to be a lake up here. Uh, just the way the land is. There's some cows sleeping over there. It's chilly outside. It's 63. It's going to snow. <laughs> so we are just taking this to see where it's going. I really hope uh, it's not a driveway again. It's looking like it might be. Orange groves, look at these beautiful orange groves here. I tell you what, you come out here right about this time, actually. We're closer to February, and anytime you're near an orange grove, you are going to get the orange blossom smell, and you will never smell anything as beautiful in your entire life. It's amazing. <laughs> Middle There's Park. your lake. Middle Lake Park. <laughs> but our point's not going point's going this way. Okay, we'll check okay. that out because that looks like fun. Now we're in Jurassic Park. Big old oaks. We got some grapevines going on. We do have a native grape here in Florida. Tastes like ass. A muscadine grape. My grandma used to make wine out of it. Old milk jugs. There's the orange grove. I guess this is a road. I don't think this is anybody's driveway. I can kind of see the lake. Kinda. Through the trees. It's a very narrow road. <laughs> this is a road. Yes, it very is. Very narrow. I feel like this is more of a utility road for the orange grove. Oh, somebody's got a rooster. <laughs> is that a that's a graveyard Ooh, that's our point that's our point cool what can I drive yeah I'm doing it oh it's pretty you, look at this beautiful tree. Wow. Wow. Look at that old sign. 
Townsend House Church and Cemetery. Let's look at it up front because oh. all I'm getting is this thing in the way. Oh. Well, I was reading it. I know, but it's so much prettier, the sign. There's a sign. This tree is about 200 years old. It's beautiful. Beautiful tree. All right. Captain John Townsend and his wife Nancy brought their family and slaves to the area from North Florida in the late 1840s. The log home they built became the center of a pioneer community and a refuge from unfriendly Indians. After 1865, when the Townsends moved to a new home nearby, settlers built another Townsend house for use as a Methodist church and three-month term school. The present building was constructed about 1880 on land donated by Joshua Mizzle. The cemetery has been in use since before 1854. Wow. This area was also the site of a substantial Indian settlement in the 16th century. Wow. I think you need to get your drone out. Ooh. Did you bring the drone? How beautiful there! Can you imagine how so what it must smell bright. like out here? All of these, I mean, with the with the orange blossoms and there's yeah. wild oranges back there. All of these trees are about a hundred. That big one back there is probably 200, 250 years old. That big one over there is probably 200 years old. There's the lake. You can kind of see it. Oh, how cool is this? Very cool. I'm gonna get the drone out. Okay. Freaking spider. Look at how massive that, that tree is. That, what kind? That, it's huge. It's a camphor tree. Have you ever seen a camphor tree that I've big? I've never seen a camphor tree that big. Holy Moses. And the thing is, is that some of these things were planted here. Yeah. Like the crinum lilies and all that, obviously. Yeah. And the sagos. As decoration, um, you'll see crepe myrtles a lot. There's one over there. There's a really pretty magnolia down there. And they plant them, you know, a hundred years ago. And then this happens. Wow. They're awfully close to them. I'm interested to go over there and see if, you know, those roots are disturbing those. Oh, they, yeah, well, let's go see. You know, there's probably, maybe it's on the other side. Maybe, they're, maybe the, the grave is on the right and not. Um, there's probably some graves under this tree. Like, I have a feeling that they planted it. I've never seen one so It's incredible. Wow. Tree, but having never been pruned ever, you can see each individual. It's massive. It's a huge tree. Header that's come up, which is a massive hurricane issue, but it's gorgeous. Yeah. It's not having any problems. No, she's thriving. Oh yeah, look at this. That is, I mean, the grave. Wow. So there's this grave over here. It's right by the tree. I've never seen anything like it. Probably, which is fine. I'd be cool with it. But poor Maud, I think, is getting crowded. Maud might be a little see crowded. How big the roots are. are. <laughs> Interesting to see. It looks like there is a grave here. If you just be careful. Mamie. Sweet Mamie. Sweet Mamie. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh, you didn't fall in a freaking grave, did you? Uh, I was worried about sweet Mamie. <laughs> oh my, oh my are you okay? Oh, <laughs> a freaking tumble. What the hell was that? Don't, be careful, it's not like a, the tree's up, uplifting things. It kind of looks like a bone. 
Oh, Jesus. It's not a bone. It's better than a bone. What could be better than a bone? <laughs> Thank God. What? A pretty rock? It's a fucking arrowhead. What? Skin my elbow. <laughs> oh my god. Coming right out of the tree root system that I tripped on. Are you kidding me right now? Wow. That's a beautiful arrowhead too. I hope I didn't break it when I landed on it with my fat ass. I'm like shaking right now. Oh my gosh. Be under there, but it's probably way under there. Wow! Look at that, guys. How cool is that? I can't believe that. It's made out of coral. Oh! <gasps> I don't know what that means, but it must be exciting. Oh yeah, it's pretty. Meaning it's, it's so not pretty. <sighs> Can you help me? You okay? Yeah, I hurt my knee. Most of them are made out of rock and limestone. This one is made out of coral because you can see through it. My dad would think this is the coolest. <laughs> <laughs> you ate Onward! Ate dirt. Please tell me you got that on camera. I don't know if I did or not. <laughs> I'm not sure. I was looking at this dang tree. Canopy in this it's place unbelievable. Is stunning. It's so pretty. It's so peaceful here. Hold on. I'm... Look at this cute. Look at this beautiful grave right here. Seriously, it's got a baby lamb on it. Oh. Y'all see that? Little Herman. Little oh. Herman. Oh. Son of Mr. and Mrs. C. E. Oh Hines. How sweet. A little time on earth he spent till God for him his angel just sent. Oh. Gosh, that is just sweet, beyond sweet. The little lammy. Oh, I wish we had some toys in the truck. We gotta plan <gasps> better for this. No, you know what you have? You what? have one of your ghost balls that light up. Oh, would you like that, little Herman? Yeah, I yeah. think you need to leave that for little Herman. Definitely. Okay, remember where this is because we'll leave it. No.
Got the drone out. We got some sweet drone footage. It is a beautiful day for drone flying. There's nothing in the air. It's a little crisp and cool so the motor doesn't get overheated. And I mean, it just does not get any prettier than this. So that footage will be awesome. And we're packed up and ready to go, except we are going to leave a couple things at some graves that we felt um, a pull towards. So we're just gonna leave little, little gift offerings. Um, both of them were babies. Both of them caught our eye and and uh, actually the ball that I was looking for somehow manifested itself in the front of the truck. So I think that's a sign we need to leave it. Do you remember when I told you to remember where they were so we wouldn't forget? Yeah. How's that going? It's been better. Ah, oh, look at this camellia. Beautiful. You know what, I'm gonna get a picture of this, this one. Baby girl, Osborne Mercer, 1939. Look at this little tiny stone. So what we picked out for you is a pine cone. It's not just any pine cone. This pine cone we actually got from the top of a mountain in North Carolina and brought it back because it was so cute. So now it's yours. Between these trees. Nice Beautiful. spot, buddy. Okay. Little Herman. We got something fun for you, buddy. This is a ball, and we'll leave it on. <laughs> that lights up if you move it. So this is yours to play with, if you'd like to have it. How fun is that? You can move that around all over the place. It'll really show up good at nighttime. I think he's going to like it. I think he's going to like it. I think he's gonna like it. Can you do that again, buddy? Oh. That was awesome. That was perfect timing. Can you do that again? Oh my God. I think it's his way of saying thank you. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> you are welcome. Wow. That was awesome. That's <laughs> super cool. I almost stopped filming too, and I'm like, no, let me just keep going I would have been so mad if I would have missed that good job good job you can do that again if you want we'll leave you alone here shortly so you can play with it all you want to but everybody was gonna see how you move that that was so cool good job Wow. one more time give it a big push he's shy he might be he might be that's okay buddy once it was enough that was amazing good job that is all yours. We'll leave it on. I don't know how long it's going to last in the weather, but maybe we'll come back in a couple months and bring him a new one and see. All right. We're walking away now. <laughs> He's shy. Bye, little Herman. Enjoy your ball. <laughs>